Hello Sagittarius, welcome back to my channel and welcome to your mid-March reading. So this is the Tarot General message. If you would like a personal private reading, please get in touch. I will be delighted, you know, to deliver your personal message. So let's begin. Five, five cards, you know, um, really and uh, clarifiers. On so each section we will have a clarifiers and we will see what is the message for you, my dear Sagittarius. Um, I think in general, March is a very interesting month with all the um, changes in planets and um, their, their constellations and movements. So overall card that we have for you is Ace of Pentacles. Really speaks about a new opportunity, a new um, project, a work um, assigned to you. Um, I do feel that also that means an investment in a long-term vision. So Sagittarius, you are really, really committing to work hard for money, uh, which is obviously not bad, but I think um, just uh, one thing that I would like, you know, to raise is, you know, check how much the time you are investing. Um, don't overdo. Yeah. It's, it seems like a, something a very beneficial in the long run, but again, there has to be a balance and, you know, make sure that this project is worth your energy, that this seed that you're planting is going, you know, to bring those great results. So that is the overall energy that I'm going to clarify. We have a Six of Swords. A six of Swords really for me speaks about that controversially that could be an opportunity that you have thought to be a really you know great and in the long run you know it would give you a benefit some sort of you know in terms of like developing skill working on you know discipline uh, learning something new but i think you know with having this combination i really do feel that six of swords is about moving away you know from this this long-term commitment so looking now as a clarifier um i think some of you actually walked away from unhealthy um opportunity environment people and moving into something more healthier so it could be two scenarios so you know really you know whatever will apply for you take it uh as as applies um but that's overall you know message for you my dear Sagittarius so when it comes to the money I'm going to pull the first card is the judgment and the clarifier is justice how interesting to have the judgment and justice at once two major arcanas so for me really what this speaks it's about something new needs to come into your life something you need to give a birth to something new because it's a time, the karma, you know, the cycle that you have been going very, very unhealthy. So we are talking, Sagittarius, about 20 years, probably, cycle. Maybe even for some of you, if you are still in that sort of age, we're about, you know, to go into 20s. Um, you have experienced many unhealthy relationships. And that could be, you know, school teachers, classmates, university pals, whatever that is, you have been always struggled to be recognized who you are. And this new path, when it comes in your, to the money, when it comes to the career, it's like you are going to be seen in a very different light by people. It's like you have been healing all this time. And, and now, with this healed energy, you're going you know, to attract completely different people, completely different opportunities that will give you an opportunity to earn that wealth, to earn that wealth in a different way. The justice is here for you, Sagittarius. So it's very interesting. When it comes to relationship, page of cups, and I want to say it's something new something new, something brand new, haven't expected. I think you will be surprised by March that you will receive an, some sort of emotional offer, an invite for coffee, an invite to meet. Maybe you've been, you know, doing the online dating. Someone who says, I really would like, you know, to get to know you um, in real life. You know, we're getting on so well 
online, you know, you seem funny, you seem, you know, so um, adventurous, whatever, but it's about a new beginning. It's about opening new doors in your relationship sector. And let's have a look what the clarifying card will say. Yeah, I think, you know, you had struggled with relationships and I think you have struggled by putting your trust in people. I think you have been really disappointed by the relationships, Sagittarius. I think you have had a really hard time to connect on heart to heart level. And I think you've been as well very harsh to yourself saying, I want, you know, that person would equally stimulate me on mental level as a spiritual and on a heart level you know i need to find someone who really connects on all those levels that i can really say this is my person if i can't find anyone like this i don't need it so you know for some of you is really sagittarius will be moving away from unhealthy relationships especially those who are heavy hard and you really feel no disconnection and some of you will open, you know, the page where you are finally recognizing that someone has, you know, that equally matching standards, what you, you know, expect from another, that same person comes, you know, with the same expectations and you connect really on the same level. So it's a beautiful, beautiful reading. Um, so when it comes to your environment, 10 of swords, it's been hard. Sagittarius, let's admit, you have been experiencing the really hardships. And I think with Pluto, you know, changing the sign, I think Pluto was sitting really very heavily in terms of your, your understanding who you are, you know, your identity to the world. Like I say, you know, clashing with, you know, all the people and their opinion about you, people not seeing a value in you and you losing, you know, that self-confidence in, in yourself. And I think you have gone you know through this i had enough you know i had enough of trying to convince people who you know my value my world worth and this environment as such is going to change is going to shift and yeah the tower you know major arcana clarifying this your environment is about to change and when i speak you know about the change and especially with the tower it can be you know unpleasant because it's sudden but I think it's so much needed and so much necessary, you know, to happen in your life. There could be home change, job change, relationship, you know, exiting, you know, from all those tox toxic things and elements that doesn't really work for you, Sagittarius. And you know that it doesn't work, but you just didn't have that strength and belief, self-belief in you that you can do something. But when we have a tower... And ten of swords is like universe sees how much you are suffering and says we need to change this environment. We need to change that toxicity around you. You need to open yourself to the world where is happy and can give you as equally you can give, you know, something good um, to each other. So very very interesting reading Sagittarius. Now when it comes conflict and challenge, we have seven of coins and then the ace of wands. So I really want to see to say some of you Sagittarius are really struggling at work. So as we said, our roll card was about the ace of pentacles and the six of swords. So it's very similar energy, but for some of you Sagittarius, you will be working, trying to prove yourself, trying to prove yourself that you have the energy and ambition and you want, you know, to achieve something better. And I think, you know, when we have the seven of coins, it's a very much proving your skill to others, you know, and ace of wands for me really speaks about a new idea, a new inspiration. Other people are seeing you. And I think, the conflict and the challenge when we are speaking it's about believing yourself first of all be believing yourself that you have the skill that you have the passion that you have the the sort of that you can bring something to the table so that's what it's all all about this this conflict and challenge that you have in you is finally to say yourself i know what i'm capable for no one can put a tag on me and say how much I'm worth 
or you know people you know constantly criticizing you and bullying you you need you know to make a decision whether it's worth you know to continue on this journey or to take a new inspiration a new desire of a better world and you know better money better opportunities and recognition of your worth you know people need to value you as you need you know to learn to value yourself so it's a very interesting reading for you my dear sagittarius i hope you enjoyed if you like please leave your comment share and like and um, i would be very very appreciative because it will help to grow my channel thank you so much take care and good luck